one thing I observed among the students preparing for the UPSC exam is that they will be reading extremely slow because of which they will not be able to finish the syllabus. Such students who read very slow generally will not be able to crack the examination even after 3 to 4 attempts. There may be many reasons for it. For example, some students though they have average knowledge, they will be able to read quickly, finish the syllabus, revise multiple times and get a rank. It may be because they have a good reading habit. In their school days, college days, they might have been reading more novels or whatever. That might be helping them now. But some students in the 10th or 11th, 12th or graduation, they do not read anything outside. No newspaper, no novels, no textbooks. They only read the class notes by heart that and get very good marks. Such students generally face the problem of very slow reading habit. So, you have to first of all identify whether you are a slow reader or not. So, how to identify it? One thing I would say is, in the beginning you will take much time to read newspaper articles. But if you are taking the same time for next 7 to 8 months, you are a slow reader. Secondly, as when you start preparing for UPSC, most of the subjects history, geography, economy, polity, environment may be new to you because you might be coming from MBBS background or BTEC or BSc whatever or other degree background. Most of the subjects may be new to you. So, in the first three to four months, naturally you read very slow. You, you cover very less pages in more time. But if you are doing the same thing for completely one year, then you are a slow reader. So, first you identify whether you are a slow reader or not. Identify that, realize that. Second, try to understand why you are reading slow and address the problem. For example, some of the reasons I observed among my students, some of the reasons are that, one, some students try to read very carefully to understand every word, every line in their very first reading. For example, if some words they don't understand, they will stuck there, they will be stuck there. And then, not only being stuck there, they will try to understand it, spend much time for it. Once they completely understand, then they will move forward. That is a bad habit. In the first reading, while reading, when you are reading a book, some sentences, some words you may not understand. It is okay, leave them, just move forward. In the second or third reading, definitely you will, you will be able to understand them. One thing that is, second thing that I observed is, some students in their first reading itself, they want to remember every word, they want to uh, you know remember everything, they keep underlining every sentence, feeling that everything may come in UPS examination, that is a bad habit. In the first reading, my advice is do not underline anything, just give a quick reading by understanding the overall aspect. In the second or third reading, you will naturally understand what is important, then you underline only the very keywords, so that tomorrow when you revise that book, you can revise only the the keywords. Third thing I observed among the slow readers is that they do not put any target. They just open the book, read slowly. So my advice is you keep a target. For example, today by the end of the day I have to finish these things. If you have a target, naturally your speed will increase. Fourth thing that I observed is that some students don't understand what is important for UPSC, what is not. For example, in a book, some chapters are useless for UPSC or some paragraphs are not required. You have to skip them, go forward. So, like that, I observed some factors. Similarly, you should also understand carefully what are the reasons that are keeping you, you know, as a slow reader. And one tip I want to tell you friends, one thing I observed is that to increase the reading speed, you try to spend some time every week, sometime you read other books, other novels or things irrelevant for UPSC. Just for your passion, for interest you read something. Because such things you will read fast because they are not given in the exam, questions will not come in the exam, you will read fast. So if you do that kind of reading for some time in a week, naturally the effect will be there in the UPSC also. The speed of UPSC syllabus also, UPSC books also will be increasing gradually. So identify whether you are a slow reader, you realize whether you are a slow reader, then identify why you are reading slowly, then solve it. Only then you can crack the UPSC examination quickly, otherwise you will be stuck in the preparation for 6 to 7 years. So all the best, do well.